Hi, I'm Letita Rones, a librarian at Cal State LA University Library. In the previous two-minute tutorial in this series, I showed you how to be a research detective and investigate. You identified background information and used it to develop a research question about your topic of choice. In this second part, I'll show you how to expand your information gathering once you have a research question in mind. There are three types of research questions. First, descriptive questions. These report characteristics, demographics, behaviors, or components. An example might be, what percentage of college students have felt anxiety or depression in the last year? Second, observational questions. They distinguish, detect, or observe what happens. For example, what happens to the migration pattern of the monarch butterfly in warm climates? Third, relationship-based questions, which examine the cause and effect or impact of change one factor has on another. Something like, what are the positive effects of upward bound on academic success in college students? Research questions consider relationships between factors. They require investigation and evaluation. Your question may have multiple answers depending on the perspective or argument. Your job is to persuasively argue the answer to your question. In our last tutorial, I came up with a descriptive research question. It was, how have activists used art to advance the Black Lives Matter movement? To answer this descriptive question, I will locate and read books, journal articles, and primary sources in OneSearch to build a thesis statement or an argument. Type Black Lives Matter and art in OneSearch. Results show articles about how black women artists protested the police killing of Breonna Taylor. Another article examines student-created Black Lives Matter murals. Another reports on art curriculum focused on this movement. I can cite these articles to describe how three distinct artist groups, black women artists, student artists, and art teachers have created and used art to spread the word about Black Lives Matter. Research questions can help you identify which academic resources to cite to answer your question. They help shape and focus your research investigation, moving from a reference or encyclopedia article to get background information and facts, and then locating academic resources based on the question you're trying to answer. Remember, the question you will ask will shape your research investigation. Be sure to check out all the videos on our two minute tutorial series on our social media channels and on our website at calstatela.edu library.